welcome back. So today I have a fun video for you guys. It's a haul video. I know a lot of you guys have been wanting to see more hauls and stuff. Um, so here we go. Um, so this past week slash weekend, I was in Vegas um, with my my Ohana and um, if you want to check out the vlogs, I'll have my vlog channel linked below. You can check it out. We had so much fun. I was so glad to get to see them. I haven't seen them in like over two years and it was a well needed break and I did just a little bit of shopping. Not only because my birthday was Saturday, um, but because I was in Vegas and I just wanted to kind of buy shit. I don't know. Um, so I'm going to do a haul of what I bought for Vegas. I do have a birthday haul that will be filmed later this week, end-ish. Um, I ordered a few things for my birthday and I'm still waiting for that to come in. And then I have some friends that have gifts for me, so I'm going to wait and do that either next week I think I want to film next week or if I have time during this weekend I will do that but anyways enough with the intro and let's watch the stuff uh, I mean wait what I don't eat English what what is English I don't know um, and I have a thing on Facebook but it's okay so the first thing I'm going to show you guys is I bought it at the airport um, on my way home and I realized that I have not purchased a single Vegas item and when you go to Vegas you pretty much want everyone to know you're in Vegas and um, I pretty much let everybody Facebook Instagram I think Twitter I don't know but mainly Facebook and um, I spammed a little bit on Instagram um, so I decided to pick up the shirt and it says Vegas Las Vegas yes Las Vegas and it has the little like Las Vegas logo. I thought it was really cute and really simple and um, it'll be like a really cool comfy t-shirt for like nighttime or just for like every day. Um, hopefully it'll fit because <laughs> um, I got an extra large and usually I wear a bigger size but this one's like really stretchy and I really liked it and so I got that at the airport because I failed at getting other things from there. Um, let's see. Where should we start? So, one of the places that we went to was a beauty supply store. And I got a few things while we were there. Because, I don't know, like, every time I go to a beauty supply store, I'm just like, I must look at the makeup. So, they had a bunch of NYX stuff. And I only got one thing, but it was so cheap. Like, it was so freaking cheap. Like... I didn't even, like I paid 10 bucks for this and usually I pay 13 or 14 so I got the NYX Stay Matte but not flat powder foundation. I got it in ivory because they didn't have the porcelain. Hopefully this won't be too dark. If it is I can use it as, you know, do like a light dusting and it won't be as dark. But I love this powder so much and I'm like running low on powder so I got this it's just fabulous I hope it's not too dark I'm really hoping it's not because it looks pretty light but it might be too dark but um hopefully not <laughs> I don't know like I tested it in the store and it seemed like it matched but at the same time I always have that problem like my face is like super pale compared to everywhere else so I'm gonna try that now it was like 10 it was 9.99 yeah so, I mean, this is cheaper than anywhere else I've ever gotten it, so. And then I got a, what is it, Ruby Kiss? I think these are from Ruby Kiss uh, Matte Lip Lacquers, and this is in Pool Party. This is gorgeous. Um, I did a photo shoot with my um, bestie Domi, so I wore this, and I loved it, and it stayed on. We went to In-N-Out afterwards, and it stayed on through eating and drinking and all that. But it's just a really pretty light blue. The, the texture is like really moussey and it dries but it's not like drying. So I was really glad to get that. And then I got a Nika K lipstick in the Ultra Slicks lipstick in. If it has a name, which I don't think it does. 
yeah I don't think it does but it's like this really cool like dark teal color which hey I don't have anything like this in my collection so I kind of needed it um anything you know blue ish I was like yes I need it um and then I got this one like lip balm it's a keep calm and love lip balm but I don't really like this at all it's I think it's from Rimmel but it smells like old lady it smells like baby powder like the old cosmetics that you would get when you were younger and it was just gross and I don't like the smell and you can like taste it it's just it's not my cup of tea that's for sure so yeah but um like the only like downside was I had like really really chapped lips in Vegas and I needed something so I tried this and it failed I mean it didn't even moisturize it just irritated the hell out of me so um that was interesting <laughs> And then we stopped by Walmart, and their Walmart had a bunch of e.l.f., so I went and bought some dishes. I got the dramatic ones, and then the natural ones, because I need some for my kit, so that'll be great. And then I found these in the Halloween section, and these are like purple and glittery and just fabulous, and I can use them for my upcoming series. Um, for exploration beauty that I'm going to be doing like different makeup looks of different genres of style in Japan so I definitely going to use those in one of my upcoming looks and then we went to Ulta and I love Ulta so so much um, and of course I had to get some stuff so I got my free birthday gift a Bare Minerals Marvelous Moxie lip thingy and birthday babe and it's pretty like I really liked it it was really kind of interesting to try to get the birthday gift because they didn't want to give it to me because I didn't have a card like the, the like birthday card redemption code but they had sent it to the wrong email and I was in Vegas so I couldn't like figure it out um but my my domi she went in there and got it for me so i was really really happy even though we probably caused the scene oh well but it's so gorgeous it's like a pinky peachy reddish taupey color and it's got so much glitter in it like pink and gold glitter and i really 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 love this so thank you for helping me get this domi because i honestly was about to walk away and be like eh, it's okay whatever but no she was like now you're getting your birthday shit um then i picked up a sample of the benefit Roller Lash. I've been wanting to try this, but I did not want to dish out the money for the big one, so I got this, the little sample size, so I can try it out. Um, I got an EOS lip balm, which is my savior. It saved my lips, and I will never, ever forsake EOS lip balm again. Never, 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 never. Oh, it's so amazing. I love it so much. So, and this was like the raspberry one. I love it. And then I got the Essence Mega Glam Eyeshadow, and this is in Golden Up. And it is exactly like the Stila, um, like, shadow pigment stuff. It ex looks exactly the same, goes on exactly the same, like the, I'll put the name here. But it's exactly the same, and this was $3, and that was like 30 so I win. Goals! And while I was at Ulta, they gave me a lollipop. So I thought that was really cool. It's a blue lollipop. I haven't eaten it yet, so um, I don't know. I can't determine the taste. And then we went by Best Buy because they bought me something really awesome that I'll show you guys later. And they got me some other stuff for it. And while I was there, I won a little giveaway and I got a free car charger. So I thought that was really cute. Um, they were giving away like free baggies for like the first 100 people and you just pick what you, pick a bag and I got a car charger which and it has like dual parts so that's kind of cool you know if I'm in the car I can always be like time to plug in my stuff um yeah and then we went by Hancock Fabrics and the one that's by her house is closing and so everything was like 30 to like 90% off and we raided that store 
Um, I've got three patterns. They're all originally like $26, $28, which I came out hella good. Um, I got this one with costumes. Um, I can use, I'm going to be using like the corsetti part for an upcoming cosplay. But I thought this was really cute and it has like everything in there and of course plus size. Then I got Sailor Moon costumes, the schoolgirl version and the magical girl version. I had to get this because it's Sailor Moon. Like why would you not want it? And then I got the um, one for just the schoolgirl, like the more vintage ones for the other like anime girls I went to cosplay because this one will be really good for the girl from Uto no Prince Sama. I forgot her name. I, Haru-chan. Yeah. That will be perfect for her. And then, yeah. And this kind of reminds me of Sailor Mars. So, I just thought it would be really good to have. Um, Domi, she got a bunch too, so it was pretty cool. And she got a free pattern, so that was pretty neat. And then I got some fabric that was really expensive, but with the discount, it was so cheap. So, I got this huge, huge, I think I got like, I asked for three yards, but I think she gave me more, of this lime green glittery fabric. And... Oh my god, this is perfect for an upcoming cosplay I'm doing. Um, because our next, the next con that I'm going to will be, uh, Momocon 2017, since I'm going to Japan next year. That way I have plenty of time to get ready. And, like, the fabric was originally $21 per yard, but I, I got it for, um, $8 total. So, that's pretty awesome, like... I mean that's that's a big that that's huge um like the patterns were like let's see like one pattern was like eight bucks like they're all that like seven eight bucks for the pattern so I made out like a damn bandit that's for sure and then we got some Japanese candy which most of it is gone now but if you go to my vlog channel we have a we're gonna have a little segment on there um, where we tried the Asian candies, but I did bring some back home with me, um, and the Kit Kat, I got some green tea Kit Kats, I got these little rice cakes, um, green tea Kit Kat, uh, let's see, Ugh. I did get some Pocky, but I didn't like it, so I left it with her husband, um, because he really liked it, so let me, I got a cheesecake Kit Kat, which you can like put in the microwave oven or like toast it or something. So I'm gonna try that. Um, and then I tr tried these, like they're like green tea caramels, and they were really interesting. Um, and I brought some home with me, so yeah. <laughs> um, so I think that is it for my Vegas haul. I will have a birthday haul coming up soon. Um, like I said, probably next weekend. Um, after, because I'm having, like, my little birthday party thing with my friends here in Georgia, Friday, so, I'll also be vlogging, so, go check out my vlog channel, you'll see some really cool stuff, and you'll get to meet my Ohana, and, um, so, yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this video, if you did, give it a thumbs up, and if you are not subscribed, you should subscribe, because I do crazy makeup, and... I like to do weird things with my face and that didn't come out right but you know what nothing ever does <laughs> um but thank you guys so much for watching really hope you enjoyed and i will see you guys in my next video bye